Welcome if you are new. In today's video, I'm going to be decorating my brand new Christmas tree in my living room. And this tree has a golden theme to it. I just got this tree this year from Walmart. I did have the same tree before. And um, I, oh my gosh, there was such a mix up last year. Some lights went out and I'm pretty sure I threw it outside. I don't know. It's a long story, but I had to get a new tree. So um, I really do love this tree. It is such a great deal. It is a seven and a half foot pre-lit flocked Birmingham fir tree. And it has um, 400 lights and it has 1,336 memory wire branch tips, which I think is amazing because if it looks like last year's tree or whenever I bought that tree, whenever you pull it out, it is already almost fluffed. You don't have to do a whole lot of fluffing. So that is great. It is a little big for the space that I'm putting it in. Um, but I went to Home Depot and I wanted to compare the trees, which I do have some trees from Home Depot that I love, by the way. But there was one almost identical to this and it was $2.99 and I couldn't see the difference. And then they had the same version, but smaller, like a skinnier one. And it was $1.99, still more than this. And um, probably would have been better for this corner because I did squeeze it in there. And I think like there were mixed reviews on if other people liked it or not, but I liked it. I thought it was cozy and it worked for me. So I went ahead and got the tree this year. So I'm gonna go ahead and set that up and we are going to start decorating. Also, I wanted to show you my festive Christmas sh shirts that I got at Target. This cute t-shirt and this fun sweater. It is like a cute, ugly Christmas sweater. So um, if you wanna know, I will link that in the description box as well as the tree. <laughs> setting it up and there's very minimal flocking for putting this rather large tree together so I'm really pleased with that and I just love the warm glow of the lights and yeah this is my only flocked tree that I have I have seven trees and I'm pretty sure this well I have a pink a pink flock one so <laughs> Okay, like I said, this tree has a golden theme and I'm going to start by putting the picks in and the garlands in. I don't put ribbon on this tree, but I do have a few garlands that I'm going to drape the tree with. And I think this tree is much easier to decorate than the family room tree. That one, whew, that one gives me headaches sometimes, but here we go. Okay. Got a ton here of some golden. Oh my goodness. Look at all of these 
beautiful golden ornaments. Now this tree is a very sophisticated, elegant looking tree. If you have different tree styles, I probably have a tree that fits your style. I decorate seven trees in my house. So um, check out my other videos if you wanna see some other trees. I have a big nine foot red and green traditional Christmas tree. I have some elf themed Christmas trees in my boys room. Um, I have a new this year tree which is a white tree and it's um candy land themed i've got a little pink flock tree and yeah I, I don't even know what i'm missing but uh definitely check out my other videos if you want to see some more christmas tree decorating inspiration i love these garlands i got them at hobby lobby and they are oh my gosh super cheap i don't even remember how much but they're so beautiful and they just drape and they're very subtle in this tree I've always wondered what this all this gold stuff would look like on a green tree but who knows because I just have always put it on the flock so I'm going to start up here with this gold garland and I can barely reach I didn't really get that Ow. I'm just gonna go ahead and play some music so you guys can watch me decorate instead of listening to me heavy breathing and then uh, we can check everything out whenever it's all done. It's cold outside, but the fire keeps us warm. We can spend the night underneath the mistletoe. And I've gotten you a present that I put under the tree. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for you and me. The snow is falling down, and the storm is on its way. But as long as you're around, everything will be okay. Cause all I want to do is spend this holiday with you. Tomorrow it is got the gold little things hanging down and then there's the beads and then these beautiful gold leaves uh, those are just amazing I don't know if these are still available um, I will try and find a link but I got them several years ago from Wayfair and yeah I just think that looks so beautiful now these are floral stems that I got in the floral department at Hobby Lobby and they are gold and fabulous and I use those to make the tree topper with so I'm going to go ahead and place those now.
but a little bit over there. But it's just wild up there, and I'm gonna add some picks at the top to kind of blend it in uh, and come down throughout the tree with the picks that kind of coordinate with that. These are one of the other picks that I use. I use it on my other tree downstairs too. I just love these. They are so beautiful. I got these at Hobby Lobby as well. I'm gonna add some of these to the topper and then put them all throughout the tree. other picks that I'm using got these beautiful these beautiful frosted berries in like silver and cream like a very champagne look a champagne gold berry and then I've got some poinsettias um, I've got gold and white so I'm gonna get these fluffed out and start filling the tree with the picks picks are my favorite um, part of decorating a Christmas tree. I just love how they fill in the tree. There are just so many different ways you can give your tree character with so many different types of picks. some that I haven't found yet um, I do have this Lennox Disney castle from last year that is so pretty and even if I found any more ornaments I don't know if I have any free spots so I am going to get this mess cleaned up and I will show you the final look all right, this is the finished look in my living room, and this is the tree that you see whenever you walk in the front door. And I just love this look. It's very glamorous and luxurious. It's just so beautiful and cozy, and fits right in with everything in the decor. And I can't wait to show you guys everything, but the house just isn't ready enough to do a complete tour but I will have a complete tour up on my channel so make sure you are subscribed and hit that bell notification so you don't miss out on a video this is my beautiful view from the couch I just think it is absolutely gorgeous I love Christmas decorations they are my favorite decorations of the year just so cozy and such 
an amazing feeling, which is why I decorate so early so I can enjoy it longer. Obviously, traditions are a big part of Christmas, and coming up with something different every year is not always feasible. This is the same setup that I had in here last year, but I loved it so much. There was nothing that I wanted to change. I love my trees. I've had those for some number of years now, and for some reason, I just love how simple they are and how structured they are, and I love these little white houses that I just set up here. And these stockings are everything. They are so gorgeous. I love how extra long they are. And then I just added the ribbon and I will link the stockings if you are interested in them. I think they have them in red as well and they are just stunning. I've got my hearth in hand letters to Santa box that I got several years ago. I believe they even have a new one out this year that is gold. It is so beautiful. I love my Nutcracker and my big Santa. And this tree is just so gorgeous. It is like a golden, a creamy golden color. And it's just covered in sparkles, which is kind of hard to see, but it is so sparkly and glittery. And I have it in my pottery barn vase and I will link the vase if you're interested in that as well it is still available and I can also link my gorgeous chairs my favorite one of my favorite things in the house so I can link the chair and this gorgeous fur throw I love so much it is stunning And also this mirror, so beautiful. I would love to hear what you think in the comments down below. And if you are just tuning in, I would love if you would consider subscribing to my channel. I would appreciate it so much. And thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.